Shiver me timbers! Hello Internet, and today we are going to review international version of Xiaomi Huami MS Feed. What is Xiaomi MS Feed, you may ask? Well, it is an amazing combination of functionality and style merge in a single piece of incredible smartwatches for a very acceptable price. I'm not going to describe the appearance of the device since there are plenty of pictures and videos of it in the Internet. Instead, I will notice that the device has an eye-catching, more sporty than classic design that will most likely suit the jogger rather than the man in a suit. However, if you will try to replace standard 22mm rubber straps with something made of metal or leather, it may change the picture a bit. At first glance, it may seem that backlight of display lacks brightness. However, it compensated by all LED technology that allow it to create very contrast images on the display and that is why all the pictures and text will stay readable even on the direct sunlight. Among standard function, a must-fit has heart rate, calories, mileage, pace, speed and cadence monitoring that will be involved in one of four different modes such as walk, run, run, indoor and trail run. In upcoming updates, biking and biking indoors modes that already installed on Chinese version will be added. Lower in setting you will find some setups for non-professional training that heart rate is above the predetermined limit or message that you are running slower than my grandma. You may also set up time or distance after overcoming which Amazon feed will send you a notification. After this certain exercise you can see the statistic throughout the day. Also very convenient function the Xiaomi Band 2 Lux and Amazon feed has is constant heart rate monitoring that will work even if you are are not using any sport mode at a time. MS Feed has its own storage where you can store your own music. To upload it, simply connect the device to your PC and copy paste files to the music folder. You don't need your smartphone to be connected to play music, however, it will require some Bluetooth headphones. Another function is sleep monitoring mode that will be turned on automatically every time you are going to sleep. All the information will be recorded and you can get access to it through your watches. Instead of Mi Feed, Xiaomi MS Feed prefer to use its own application called Huami MS Feed that basically serves only for synchronization with your phone and allowing you to choose from big variety of watch faces. And in future, I guess there will be even bigger choice. App also allowing you to set up notification. By the way, almost forget to mention that device allowing you to read SMS right on the watch's screen. Battery lifetime may vary from two to five days, depends on the usage. With the sport modes constantly on, the device will work about one two days. If you will use it from time to time, it may work for about two three days. And if you use it only to count your steps without GPS, which seems to be eating the most of the battery life, it may work for four or even 5 days. Display protected by Corning Gorilla Glass and can easily be standing some accidental hits during the usage. It may even be used under the heavy rain or shower, however I would not recommend you to use the device for swimming. With the watches in the box you will find USB cable, charging dock and English user manual. In general Xiaomi Huami MS Fit is very nice, good looking and accurate in terms of measurement device. Among the drawbacks I notice only very shitty synchronizing application and standard straps that may look nice but feel very uncomfortable on the skin. So I may advise to change it to something better since it's removable. For the rest it's very good smartwatches, device is easy to navigate, have attractive design, accurate sensors and very decent battery life. And that is all for today. If you want to buy MSV, just follow the link in the description. And if you like the video, give us your like, subscribe to our channel, and leave your comments in the section below. I'm Elijah, thank you for watching, and farewell.